What is a drug? You can pause the video here and have a think. See if you know the names of any drugs. A drug is a substance that when released into the body will cause an effect. Drugs may be recreational, where people choose to take them, or medicinal, where they are used to treat diseases. Depending on the country, drugs can be legal, like caffeine, or illegal, like heroin in most countries. In this video, we'll look at how medicinal drugs or medications are developed to treat certain diseases. But first, let's be clear on what a disease is. You can pause the video again and see if you can come up with a definition. Diseases are when parts of the body do not function properly and they usually produce symptoms. Diseases can be chronic or acute. Chronic diseases are long-lasting, often incurable, they get progressively worse over time. Medical treatment focuses on managing the disease to slow it down and reduce symptoms. Examples of chronic diseases include diabetes, epilepsy, most cancers, heart disease and arthritis. Acute diseases have sudden onsets and progress quickly. Treatments include taking drugs and or surgery. Examples of acute diseases are colds, flu, a broken leg or a liver disease. So how can diseases be treated? Apart from surgery, physiotherapy, plaster casts and other inventions, many diseases are just treated with drugs. There are four important characteristics of drug treatment. The medication must be effective. It must prevent or cure a disease or at least make you feel better. It must be safe. The drug must not be too toxic or poisonous or have unacceptable side effects for the patient. It should be stable. You must be able to use the medicine under normal conditions and store it for some time. And it must be successfully taken into and removed from your body. It must reach its target and be cleared from your system once it's done its work. Current drug testing procedures are very strict and thorough, but they haven't always been so rigorously tested. In the 1960s, a drug was prescribed to pregnant women to lessen the symptoms of morning sickness. The name of this drug was thalidomide. The drug did indeed lessen the symptoms, but it had some severe side effects. Children of women who had taken thalidomide whilst pregnant were born with shortened or absent limbs. The use of thalidomide caused deformities in an estimated 20,000 babies and killed 80,000. Some doctors had concerns about thalidomide back in the 1960s. Dr. Frances Kathleen Oldham Kelsey was a pharmacologist and a physician. She had concerns about the drug's safety, which later proved to be justified, and she ended up saving the lives of many people in the USA, as thanks to her, the drug was never used there. Since the thalidomide tragedy, laws have been introduced to ensure all drugs go through rigorous testing before they can be prescribed to the general public. You can learn more about the testing process in this video. We can now all feel far safer when taking medicines. If you liked the video, give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe. Comment below if you have any questions. Why not check out our Fusco app as well? Until next time.